Well, I want to show paintings that I've been working on. I'm getting ready to dress my loom again. I haven't woven probably for three months. And I've got an order to make something, so I'm going to address my loom and start doing that in a couple of days. But I, before I started on the next weaving project, I wanted to show you guys paintings that I've been working on. Some of them are going to be for a show that I'm going to be having, and some of them I'm just working on them. And this is part of the painting. This is not going to be in the show. I'm just working on this maybe. Those two. Those there. And there's a couple there. That's simple. It's like, well, I want to show you paintings that I'm working on. There's one, there's two, there's three, there's four, there's five, there's six, there's seven, and there's eight. Do I have to say any more about the paintings? But they're very personal to me. I've been working on some of those for four or five years. Some of them I just started about three months ago, I guess. I think I'll just turn the camera off and walk up to each individual painting and we can look at it. This painting here I've been working on for about five years. All of my work is about evolution, mainly the evolution of our planet. I wouldn't consider these happy paintings. I just consider them, this is what I'm doing, I'm painting these paintings and they have to happen to do with um, evolution, the evolution of our planet as a human species of just fill in the blank, whatever. Uh, the paintings that I've shown the last two, these two over here, those are newer. I've just started working on those for a while. These paintings over here, I've been working on for a while. A long time. I've probably worked on the first one for about four years, off and on. And it's been different things, but it just looks like that now. This one I started a long time ago probably five years ago, and I just started working on it again today. I trimmed my uh, water lily leaves from my water lily. They were just taken over the whole pond, and, th and those things dried, and I liked the way they looked, so I just glued them onto this. 
And there's another painting that I've been working on. I just started working on this again. I started that about three years ago and just kind of glued stuff on it and went, oh yeah, that looks all right, and just put it away. I burn up a lot of paintings about two years ago, but there are some paintings I didn't burn up, and these are those paintings. Except the other two that I just started. This is a relatively new painting. I could talk more about that, but I'm not going to. And the end of, that's awful. But anyway, you know, I won't, don't want to get into it. And I just drug this out. I don't know. This is like to uh, uh, whatever, cutesy or you know, lost and found stuff and you just glue on a board and it looks like that. So it's a start, but more, I mean, all that would be completely covered with whatever and you won't be able to recognize anything on there. Pretty much. This is what I think by the time I get done painting on this. I'll cover it with layers of thin paper and all of this will be covered up and it will mainly just be textures and shapes. This kind of looks like the devil. Where is it? Or, you know, my interpretation of a devil-like creature or image. We'll say image. We'll say a devil-like image. Well, that's those paintings. And here are these two. Those two I just started working on not long ago. All of those over there have, I've been working on for a while. And I've been working on this painting for about five years. I can work on really almost all these paintings for the rest of my life. But, you know, I think they're getting, some of them are getting more to completion. But who knows? We don't know that. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.